Welcome back to Man of Outdoors. I'm your host, Kerry Mackey. It's good to be back with you here on the range. As you know from social media, from our Facebook page and Twitter and Instagram, we have been working on some night vision uh, technology and thermal. And this is all new for me. And it may be new for you. And we have been able to acquire a Sightmark Photon 4x6 by 42S, which is a digital night vision scope. And really excited about it. We just got it mounted up. Today we're at the range. You're gonna to get to see us sighted in for the first time. Uh, pretty excited about this. Uh, I have been looking forward to bringing you this video uh, ever since we got access to the, uh, the Photon here over the last month. So, I know you hear the trains in the background. Not sure how close it's gonna get, but it may get loud. But it is what it is, we're on the range, it's what happens. Um, we have also uh, put a couple of other little pieces to the puzzle. As I began to research uh, night vision, I learned very quickly that ultra night vision produces a 20 IR, which I have it right here, a 20 IR, UNV 20 IR illuminator, which we're gonna mount up to our Picatinny rail, which will increase our visibility out past 125 yards. The Photon, as you've seen from reviews and from articles that have already been written on the Photon over the last few years, the Photon's good out to about 125 yards, maybe 130 yards with the built-in IR. And if you wanna reach out past that 125 yard range, then putting something like a UNV 20 IR on it uh, as I understand, we'll increase that range out to 250, 275, which will be a great add-on for something like this 223. The additional thing that we're doing is the Photon comes with a video out port. And so you can get video and audio out, once again, with a mini DVR that is also produced by Ultra Night Vision. This is the UNV Mini DVR. It holds up to a 32 gig card, so you can capture all of the audio. It's got a built-in mic, or you can do external mic. Pouch right here on the buttstock. You can record everything coming through the Photon with audio. And so pretty excited about that. Hopefully here over the next few months, we'll get it out on some hog hunts, and we'll be able to bring you that video as well. But I wanted to spend some time at the range today getting it sighted in. Uh, we had it mounted and boresighted by our good friend uh, Spencer Morgan at Sportsman's Outfitters in Longview, Texas. And today we're on the range and we're gonna get it sighted in for you. I uh, hope you enjoy the time on the range. I'll tell you as much as I can about it as I go and what I learn and we'll go from there. So thanks for joining us. We're gonna put some rains, uh, some rounds down range let you get an opportunity to see this thing in action. I like that. It sits really nicely. You can see quite well. Um, looks like it's zeroed in. It only takes us a couple of shots to get it dialed in. I like that. And this is during the day. I've got the lens cover closed. And so when you have the lens cover closed during the day, you can see it really well. I mean, I've got a green, uh, I've lit it up with green. It's got multiple options for colors on the reticle. And you've got like four or five, maybe six different reticles to choose from. 
and then different colors, uh, red and green, and I've got it chosen for green. Looks great, shoots, shoots, well, it's my AR, I kinda like my AR, I built it myself, so, shoots well, I like the, the optics, I uh, see very clearly. Uh, we'll get to see what it looks like on the, the mini DVR, but, uh, yeah. I like the visibility of it during the day. I'm really excited about what it's gonna look like at night. All right, let's go down and take a look at the target. All right, so, walking down to the target. Now, I'm not the best shot guys, I'll tell you. But, I have a little fun every once in a while. Yeah, I kinda like that. Nice little group there. Perfect for what I'm doing. I'm using, you know, remanufactured 223. And so when I put my Hornady um, factory stuff in there, I'm sure I'll tighten those groups up quite a bit. I like it. Hope you do too.